Welcome guys. This is a special recording which we're gonna test something I haven't tested before. Excuse me, coughing a little bit. So if you look here, you can actually duplicate spells, right? Once you upgrade this one in the project for the laboratory, you can debuff, you can duplicate spells. So if we come back here and if you look into the mark of impurity, where did I go? Mark, there it is. I'm going to duplicate once and I'll actually level this up to a considerable level. I think about 37 will do. So what I'm trying to do is some people have been saying that if you have mark of impurity and if you actually level up your mark, so if you have the trial, you will actually debuff three different marks if you have three of them duplicated. I want to try that out. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the Go to the mark section and go here. I need to be 41. So both of the skills need to be 41 here. Feel free to look around though. Not need to actually. Because they just need the HP exploding, right? I'll just get to 41. Not that expensive. So at 40, you can duplicate the next one. I'm going to duplicate next here and I'll get this one to 41 as well. What's going to happen is let's see if we actually do debuff enemy three times, which we can't see. But this may be very interesting. Because if you happen to debuff enemy three times with the trial, that's really broken. <laughs> so let's see, let's see. People have told me this ages ago when it was available, but I was very reluctant to actually, you know, try it out. I was like, no, nah, I don't know. Like, I don't know if it's good or not, and we might just break the game. <laughs> but now since we're testing with online account, we'll give it a try. So I manually leveled up to 41 for each of them. So we go for those. We actually don't. I actually can't get that one. Damn, <laughs> miscalculated. And this one doesn't spread, that's okay. So not spreading is okay because one of them spread, that's all good. I just want everything here. So this is a big one. This one allows me to explode for maximum HP. I can't get this one though. <laughs> I forgot I won't have the 10 points. So here we go. This is all because of the trial, made it possible by the trial. And this is the correct item, yes. Let's go for untended. Let me guess. Let's you see how fast we can clear here. Chance weak enemies. Movement speed, lower willpower, specialist can get something. Uh, let me see your status on here. The specialists get auto modified. Specialist is really easy because they can be controlled. And yes, I'm going for my hybrid summoner mage. And here we go. Oh, this could be a good map. I actually don't see damage. So wait. I can't tell if the trial is actually applied three times or not. There's no way of seeing on the debuff on the enemies. But, you know, maybe interesting. What I might see is the amount of damage dealt when the summary of the untinted run finishes. Maybe we can see something. That's what I'm hoping for, actually. So, I'm gonna come back to this boss. Oh, he charged. Hey there. <laughs> So, 90 million pretty much. I got him. Yeah, I got him. Pretty quickly, actually. So, maybe this are playing three times. I'm not sure because we can't see. But hey, <laughs> if it does apply three times, oh boy. <laughs> but the question is because the trial, because the mark does have a cooldown. So technically, you wouldn't apply three times unless you have no cooldown. But it's not worth it to run into no cooldown because it's not possible. There will always be a cooldown there. So I'm not sure if the logic works or if people just bait me in spending up a lot of the primordial essence, which we don't have much. Maybe. One thing for sure, the trial and the mark is very powerful in this meta. One of the strongest. I do have a backup though. If they nerf the try and everything, we're going to the force your mage fully. I mean, it's not really a backup, but rather no noticing there will be a shift in the damage change. Oh, and then it's here as well, right? Yeah, it's here too. Okay, it's a big one. That's really good. So it's a big one, so not too scary. Now we're rolling to the big one. We don't run to the small one, because the big one can't move. <laughs> uh, 
once one explode everything dies he grabs me while he grabs me i still have the ops casting so that we still get some life back i'm not killing them awfully fast though to be honest i usually kill them at this rate anyways i even pass that at times so yeah i don't think we're getting the triple <laughs> triple mark yet How did I? Yes. Because the try auto applies a mark, when one dies, everyone dies in explosion. Okay, boss is up. Let's go to the boss. I do want to rush this one a little bit, just to see how much damage and how quickly we're going to do this. I don't run too fast though. Oh, boss, boss, boss. You know what I can do with the boss, guys? <laughs> I always do this when I get a chance. So he's got a bunch of shield, he's gonna charge. What? One, two, three, four, five. Oh boy, it feels good, right? So, what did I do there? <laughs> Was I recognized I can burst the boss down really low with my transform, and there you go. <laughs> this is how you kill the boss. It's actually so easy to kill the boss now. I had about 40% of my bar with transform. Oh, 3 minutes 42 seconds. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> is that an element rain? No, it's not element rain. So, legendary allows the caster to use Thunder Strike. Awkward. Uh, movement speed, critical chance. Not that great. Yeah, 96 minutes. I do believe this is from my transformation. So, what I did was I transformed into God of War. Or the not God of War aspect of War, and I did my Frenzy attacks five times, and I used the second spell to AOE him. I can't one shot him, but I can almost get him so low to fifteen percent. No, I one shot him after. That's the plan. Pick up sound to sell. Let's go back. Nothing too special. Please look around. I'm sure you will find yeah, anything special here. That takes your fancy. It's rare to get some really good ones. I'm not looking for a particular upgrade as well. The quality on this one is unmatched. You know what? Let's do one more. Let's see if it's as quick as this one. Maybe not so. Let's do one more. What do you mean? And so this is so we get a consistent result as well. Because that was, was surprisingly quick. Three minutes is really quick for me. Movement speed screws. Okay. This one we don't have monster summons on death. Let's see how quick this goes. My golem does have the proportion damage transformed to make me much more tanky. So we get to golems in. This map, I haven't played this for a while actually. This is not the best one, last one was the best one for the quick kill. This one is definitely not the best one, but not the worst one. The desert is the worst one for the clearance speed. Don't kill the Lambrek. <laughs> Lambrek is that thing over here. Why don't you kill it? Is just can't debuff it. If you can't debuff it, you don't do more damage to it. I like the map this is the actually. Not bad. So yeah, we can't see the number of debuffs on enemy right away. And that means we can't see if we triple debuff it. Probably not. <laughs> I knew they were after my comedy essence, right? I'm joking. So 99 million, half computed. Almost done. There you go. Oh, this is really good. Oh my gosh. This means I can one-shot the boss. Because <laughs> I have full essence now. I can actually one-shot everything. Yeah, we'll just save it for the boss. We don't have to use the down to content or anything. Because those are easy to kill. Collins up. Oh, 
Usually there's a bunch of them, I just kill them at once. But if there's not, we just keep moving. Make sure you saw far mark. Let's pull them over. Such feeble your efforts have revealed your and Oh, this is here. Ah damn. <laughs> Not good. I want to get close to the big chubby one. <laughs> Let me get close to the chubby one, please. Move it, people. Okay, get close to the chubby one. He can grab me, that's right. But I have the chance of exploding on him, you see. Oh, things are getting exploded. There you go. Oh, God. Beautiful. Oh, this might be a quick run, too. I don't even bother with those. Because I was going to use that to help me kill Untainted. If I kill this boss, maybe we'll get there. We'll keep running. I don't even go up because I know I have enough to just kill everything and get to the boss. It's like insights of how to do a speed run, right? There you go. Almost the boss now. So durable. Pick him up. Oh, this will be tricky. I don't know which way to go, so I'm gonna try to kill enough of them to know the right way. I won't get enough. Okay, forgot the right way. So, the right way is actually this way. Perfect. Now we're gonna run all the way to the boss, we're gonna transform and one shot it. It's gonna be a long run. <laughs> I wish I could run faster. This is when not having a mobility skill really settles me back because I can have a really quick clear under you know three minutes even if I can run faster. But I can't. <laughs> so just lag like it. I can't blink, I can't charge, and I can't, you know, even increase movement speed. As for the boss, what we're gonna do is we're gonna debuff the mines, we're gonna transform. We're gonna one, two, three, four, five. Bang! <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Because this is no longer good. Bang! Two shots. Bang! <laughs> so easy with the God of War, the Fire of War. Oh, four minutes. So I, I still can't tell. Oh, two almond stacks. That's really good. We we'll keep that one. The two almond stacks are not good, not bad. So we did, you know, a hundred and seven million damage with the highest hit. And the first one was about 3 minutes, 30 seconds, the second one was 4 minutes. So, it's oh my gosh, I'm in trouble. <laughs> They've been waiting for me. Monsters. Let's get out of here. So, the first one was 3 minutes and 30 seconds, the second one was 4 minutes. So, oh you know, I can't see if we're triple applying the debuffs, because I don't think I'm killing monsters that fast. Or maybe they already get maximum stack anyways with the trial anyways. So what well, the myth busters or oh, the testing here for the triple mark is not great. You don't need to spend resource to unlock triples like this if you have the trial. It's not usable. I think just one is enough. And if you don't have the trial, this means you're not losing out on massive damage. Because after testing with the trial, I don't see the difference. It's just fortunate enough I get my runs quickly with the map. And I was able to kill monsters fast. I was able to use my transformation correctly to get damage done. The triple Please mark is not doing much. I'm sure you'll Don't need that. Something that takes your don't fancy. need this. This one is not great. Probably don't need this one. I can keep it for a uh, base to craft on. Yep, that's everything. Uh, don't need this one. This can go here. So there you go, guys. After Come testing again. the... You know, the triple mark of impurity with trial, it's not working. But we still do lots of damage regardless, knowing the combination of, you know, you can replace one golem for the trial, have a dagger, or you can just explode to unit for massive damage and transfer for the boss. Transfer him into the the god of war here, I keep calling him, the aspect of war. Five times the first assault, the scotch go the second time. If you have more than half of your bar, you can do this twice. I can do this twice. But I can't do it twice if I don't have more than half of my energy. 
hopefully you guys enjoyed this one thank you so much for watching guys